I knew I wanted a home office space that was chic and sophisticated. A space that felt that it had been designed over a period of time rather than just being designed for in the moment. Searching for that perfect office desk proved to be somewhat of a challenge. I knew I needed a desk that was large enough to accommodate me working on large interior design projects, but not too large to overwhelm the space. When we found this small conference table, I knew that we had found the perfect desk for my space. We made some minor adjustments to the table. We covered the original gray top with a decorative faux finish, but we decided to leave the legs in its original gray color because it lends itself to an industrial look and feel. The bookcases in this space were relocated from another room in my home. And I like to accessorize my bookcases with meaningful things, items that reflect my faith to using two of my favorite decorative mean boxes for unique storage. Also, another function of the bookcases in this space is to house some of my favorite interior design books as well as some of my family portraits. The wall decor in this space consists of a gallery of starboard mirrors in different shapes and sizes, which follows the angle of the ceiling in this space. So now when it came to choosing an office chair for my space, I did not want your typical office chair. So I opted for this contemporized wing back chair with this graceful and sleek lines with the decorative nail head trim on the perimeter of the chair. Choosing art is very personal to me and I feel that art should speak to you. So when I was looking for a piece of art to hang in my space. I wanted the art to not only be beautiful but also be inspirational at the same time. Lack of storage was not an issue in this space and actually I was able to relocate some other furniture pieces from other rooms in my home to put inside of my home office, this being uh, one of the pieces. This piece reminds me of a furniture piece from in the 70s or early 80s and right now it holds my magazine collections and also in the inside I am an avid sewer so in the inside of the cabinet I am housing my sewing machine and all of my sewing accoutrements. This is a working office so quite naturally I needed a place to store my file folders so this four compartment file tower is perfect for storing my file folders. I have them sectioned off by um, different parts of my design projects from proposals to active files to invoices to also design completions. Overall, I am quite pleased with the final outcome of my home office. It is a great place to work on my design projects and it also blends seamlessly with the rest of the design style of my home. Now, uh, don't forget to comment below what's your favorite part of my home office. And if you like this video, please be sure to give it a thumbs up. And if you're new to my channel, I would love for you to hit that subscribe button to get more tips on design and decorating. Thanks for watching Designing with Hope on Design. Designing for the home, body, and soul. Bye for now.